Hey guys, welcome back to Isabel's Moments with Crafts. This is Isabel, and we're going to do a diamond painting with me. And I, it's been a while since I've done one of these, and life's been life. I just went on vacation to Oregon, so we had lots of traveling and trips, so I'll put some pictures at the end of it. <clears throat> I started this channel for diamond painting and I kind of got away from it because I found cross stitching. So I just wanted to try and make more diamond painting videos, like maybe do a time lapse with a voice recording over. Um, and hopefully this one will go better than the last time because the voiceover was bad. So, um, let's talk a little bit about my trip. Um, we, it was a 26 hour drive one way. So going there and then back, it was about a 52 hour drive. So there was a lot of crafting done in the car, mainly in cross stitch because it's really hard to transport diamond painting. And that's also one reason that I haven't been doing it because I have been doing a lot of traveling and taking it to church and stuff that I can't necessarily take diamond paintings with me unless you guys have a good way of traveling with your diamond paintings. Uh, definitely let me know. Um, I'm actually making this diamond painting, for those of you who don't know, for uh, my best friend's daughter, which, I mean, yeah, so she likes dinosaurs, so I'm doing this one. And it's not a typical one that I would do, and maybe that's why I'm not a whole lot into it. It's because it's not one that I would do for myself. And there's like five or six symbols that are blurred and they look the same so it's hard to read and I think my light pad was going out too but I think it was just the cord and then my cat mystery she's beautiful um wanted to help and so she was jumping up and it was impossible because I was fighting with her fighting with the drills trying not to drop them and like dropping them a couple of times it gets it gets kind of annoying so i need to figure out a way i can do diamond painting and cross stitching which i think i'm gonna do like every other day maybe do like diamond painting one day cross stitching another day and like kind of alternate so I'm like still diamond painting and I'm still cross stitching and maybe I'll do like the time lapse and do like a voiceover so you can see like the progress while I'm making it I don't know does that sound like something you like and this is my second time recording if I haven't said that the first time it it was very weird so I had to re-record it so I'm hoping the second time goes better um we went to the Craters of the Moon in Idaho we visit Yellowstone National Park where we saw the geyser of Faithful that shot up way high in the sky and we also saw um part of the Grand Canyon and that was really fun it was so gorgeous like I said I'm gonna leave some pictures at the end that I took of it and we also saw a water bottle water bottle waterfall before we got to our location in Lincoln City Oregon and it was beautiful it was like two hours away we went to the beach, and that was fun. It wasn't fun coming back because going to it, it was like all downhill. So coming up is like all uphill. 
which is not fun. Uh, my calves hurt by the end of like the first second day because there was a lot of walking. And then we saw a lighthouse and we went to another beach. And I saw part of a jellyfish and it was like clear and it was like squishy and it felt really cool. And I brought some souvenirs home from the beach and a rock from Yellowstone. So, I mean, it's all sorts of fun. I got to see all my cousins, all my aunts and uncles that I haven't seen in years. And I did a play with one of my cousins, with a bunch of my cousins. And we hung out and we went shopping with my aunts and my cousins. So that was super fun. We took family pictures of like all my mom's siblings and all of us. And then we did our family, our meetup family. So my brothers and sisters and nieces and nephews. And then we took another one at the beach, which I was late to because I was shopping and I forgot we were going to take pictures <laughs> at like 2.30. Huh, my bad. So, yeah. And then my grandpa and my grandma showed up and it was just, it was, it was so fun. It was amazing. And my, we went to a park in Oregon I think it was La Grand, Oregon, where where my brother played at that park when he was little. So that was that was fun. It was a fun little park, and we had like lunches and dinners, and it was just, I it was fun. And so yeah. Um. So what have you guys been up to? What what craft are you guys into are you still into diamond painting do you like cross stitching or what's your what's your favorite piece that you are working on i'd love to know i have so many that i'm just like i i just want to work on all the things and i can't because there's so many things um maybe i was i was thinking and maybe I can do a like a stash video where I show all my diamond paintings and we can go through and maybe you guys can pick uh, a next one that I should start after I finish the dinosaur if that'd be something you'd be into because sometimes it's hard to come up with videos to do for diamond painting outside of them just being unboxings and diamond painting. I mean, I have so many diamond paintings that I don't really need to get more. And at the same at the same time it's like I don't know kind of into cross stitch more, but like maybe if I sort of one that I really really wanted to start, maybe that would change it or start a smaller smaller painting that I could finish. Or something like that. I don't know. How do you guys get... How do you guys stay motivated to keep diamond painting? Because I just... I feel like I've lost it a little bit. And maybe it's because I just overdid it. And didn't take breaks when I needed to. And just... I don't know. And that's weird. But I hope you guys have been having a good week had a good vacation. I have a couple more days off. I have today, Monday, and then Tuesday off, and then I go back Wednesday. But my husband has Wednesday off because he works Saturday. So maybe I can do another video because it's, it's easier to do videos when he's not here. And there was a light flashing in the video. Um, it was because I was trying to uh, figure out what the symbols because there was blurry symbols that all look alike. And I was trying to figure it out though. So that's what that is. So yeah. Um, I don't know. It's kind of hard to come up with videos. But I'm, I'm, 
I it's hard to get motivated because my hours at work changed. I went from going from seven thirty to four to working now from nine thirty to six. So it's really hard to stay motivated and wanting to uh, keep working after. And I think I'm nearing the end. I'm I'm almost done. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you a picture of the section that I finished and then of the overall photo when it's done. And then I will show you some vacation some vacation videos. So thanks for watching and subscribing. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you liked it and you want more, just let me know. Happy crafting. And remember, don't sweat the small things. Bye, guys.